Welcome back. Fourth quarter action starting up. 2K Sports, happy to have you with us. Rockets leading by nine. Fourth quarter on the court for the Rockets. Harden and Gordon teaming up in the backcourt. Nene is out there with Ryan Anderson, and it's Green in at the small forward. Outside Gordon. And they double up Gordon. Jump on, jump on, jump on. You too. And the Rockets with possession here. Here's McGee. And the slam dunk by McGee. Yeah, he just punched the ticket on that one. That'll get the job done. Powerful two and jam. Rocket shooting 47%, pretty solid. And the call will be against Lonzo Ball. That's his first foul. P.J. Tucker, he's checked in for Houston. Substitution for the Rockets. P.J. Tucker. And they double up Gordon, kicks to Tucker. <laughs> Fouled in the act of shooting, a three-point play chance coming up. And giving up some height. He just finds a way to carve out a little separation. But it takes a lot of confidence and toughness to make that play. And when you watch this Rockets team, you can see just how explosive they are on the offensive end. Almost everyone on the floor can hurt you from deep. And they all know their role and execute it to a tee. Yeah, how about the concentration from Ball? Not allowing himself to be denied. Really got to wrap him up on these shots to prevent the bucket. That's good from Ball. And last season, the Rockets' offense was incredible. Then they go and add Chris Paul. They can run a team off the floor if they get hot. Two great playmakers in Paul and Harden. And making a move for Paul made a lot of teams fear what the Rockets can do now on offense. Harden draws the double. Shot clock at five. Nene, the screen. Here's Gordon. McGee with the block. And in transition, it's Ingram. Here we go. And slam dunk by Ingram. Ingram, he's still getting his weight up. He's looking pretty strong that time. Well, Brandon Ingram with the 7 3 wingspan. I mean, guard skills with the reach of a center, that gives him a lot of positional versatility. Contavious Caldwell Pope, he's checked in for Hart. And a switch here also for Houston. Capella's checked in. And you talk about the versatility of Ingram. What position, Chris, do you think he's best fit for? Well, you look at a guy like Kevin Durant, who started his shooting guard, and is now a combo forward. I mean, that might be a move for him. Shot by Gordon, wide open. It's good. The assist that time from Harden. Harden's got his fifth assist in this one. McGee is screen on Harden. Ball dishes to Caldwell Pope. Stolen by Tucker. And it's JaVel McGee with the foul. That's foul number two for him. And the next one puts him in the bonus. Houston leading by seven. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Rockets will retain possession. Man, you love the effort. Just getting the hand in there and knocking it out. Well, some of that, too, is just setting the tone by being aggressive. You need guys like this in the team. And they double up Gordon. Capella. That one drops for him. And the Rockets lead by nine. Ooh, nice assist out of the double team. Staying cool under fire. Here's Ball, and he drops in the layup off the glass. Ball's got five points in the quarter. I, I'm a fan of how Ball uses that size inside. Excellent at getting his shot off close to the basket. And Tucker kicks to Capella. Harden draws the double to the paint. It's deflected. Ingram with the steal. Caldwell Pope with a wide open look. Drills it from outside. And now just a four-point rocket lead. And Caldwell Pope can be a volume three-point shooter, meaning when he gets a lot of attempts from there, he can fill it up from downtown. Gordon, the pass to Harden. Tucker with the ball. How guarded by Stevenson. And it's Gordon missing. Well, it's been a rough game for him, but it won't sting too bad as long as they hang on to the game. Ball 
field dishes to McGee. Nice pass. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. And you can sense things now starting to tighten up. Their offense has become unstoppable. This is a beautiful thing. They are really playing to the maximum potential of their abilities right now on offense. A scary place to be in if you're deep. Harden kicks to Capella. Anderson passes to Gordon. Over Caldwell Pope. Another miss by Houston. He's tried to get it going, but the shots simply have not been there. Nothing seems to be falling. And they take the lead. Yeah, and Ball, a transcendent talent, I think, has a real skill for finding his teammates when they have those good looks at the rim. Harden kicks it to Tucker. The feed to Capella. Gordon a screen. Capella sets a screen for Harden. Back to Capella. And the dunk by Capella. And Harden is deadly in the pick and roll sets, whether he's shooting or passing. The D knows they're in trouble when he's involved. Los Angeles calls timeout. One of the stories here, James Harden getting it done today. Wow, it's time for them to switch up their defense on because what they've been doing so far is not working. A chance now to recognize our Jordan player of the game, James Harden. And I love that it's been a hard-charging performance. Jump shots have been kind of an afterthought. His main goal has been to attack the rim and put the D in some tough spots and also finishing strong. teams will make substitutions. He gets a chance now to catch up with the fourth member of our crew, Hall of Famer David Aldridge. Thanks, guys. I got a chance to hear what Luke Walton was saying to the team. He warned them they've got to get back in transition. He said they've given up way too many fast break points, and he said we have to slow the pace of the game down and force them into taking some tough shots. Kevin? And Ball just threads the needle extremely well. Fits it through tight spaces with force. I just love his ability to facilitate. And it's blocked. And there is going to be a foul. He definitely made contact with the ball. And in doing so, also got the body. So we'll see three throws here. Yeah, the defender all over. Wow. And the big man Capella has proven to be a reliable role player. A strong physical presence who takes smart shots and contributes well on the deep. Nice. Tying it up. They were a little disappointed that he couldn't give him a lead. Neither team here in the fourth generating a lot of separation. Yeah, it's been a close one. Five times the lead has switched hands thus far. A great job to get the bucket and to get to the line. When the game's on the line, you want your guys attacking like he did there. On the wing, Harden. He's guarded by Caldwell Pope. The Rockets again can't hit. Los Angeles leading by three. Here's LeBron. And LeBron throws it down hard. Oh, come on. James has made plenty of these shots during his career. He embraces the pressure. Houston's gone one and two from three-point range here in the fourth. Now here's Paul. He kicks to Tucker. The pass to Capella. Kuzma pulls it in. The defense ready for him on that possession. They had to be because he is so strong in the paint. Ron right side. That one goes in. And now a seven-point Los Angeles lead. And, and you can sense they're starting to take charge here. Yeah, and it goes beyond the small lead that they've built. They really capture the momentum. Once he gets open on the low block, it's just a matter of getting him the ball. And here's Los Angeles. They're on a 19-5 run here. Ball sets a screen for Caldwell Pope. Off the screen over Harden. James outside. Down to five on the shot clock. And Capella sends it back. Clock's ticking. They got to get up a shot. But even if they make it, you got to foul quick. Or, or, or it's, it's, it's over. It's a wrap. Here's Paul. Offensive rebound. Count it. What a beautiful shot to bring him to within three. 
Even with the suffocating defense, Capella keeps his composure, sinking these interior looks rather effortless. And now they decide to foul intentionally. Yeah, you, you have to do that, though. You can't just let him dribble the game out. And he does get the second one. And that gives them a four-point cushion. LeBron continues to add to his legacy. A dominant player on both ends of the floor. Now a timeout called by Houston. They're trailing by four. 17 seconds left to play here in the fourth. Guys, your thoughts? Yeah, it's going to be interesting to see what they draw up to get this quick shot. Well, do you go with your rhythm? You have to decide do you want something new, something that's been working, something they haven't seen. Now, that is cold-blooded. Well, we want people to tune in, don't we? <laughs> this is what they're tuning in to. Big moments. He hits the first one, and that makes it a three-point lead. And so he drops them both. It's a four-point ball game. And that's the knockout blow right there, guys. Those free throws should put this one away. Now a timeout called by Houston. They're down by four. We've got 13 seconds left in the fourth quarter. We've got 13 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Connects from downtown. Living for the big moment. His composure in the clutch is phenomenal. They're going to prolong the game here with an intentional foul. He doesn't hit the first, and that way is the one they really want. He's got one more, though. He's able to hit the second one, and that will put them up by two. Nine seconds left in the fourth quarter. To the paint. Harden is so good at finding the open man and the selfish superstar who really whips the ball over quickly. Here's LeBron. He got it! Oh, wow. he got it's it. good. It's good. And James loves these big moments. He isn't afraid to shoot it when the game is on the line. So it's Los Angeles taking the W in a close one. What a show they put on here at home tonight. I mean, these are those games that feel so great to win, and, and really, it's like a knife in the gut to lose. Uh, you you got to love being on edge of your seat and just wondering what's going to happen. How is this thing going to play out? And a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge, standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much. LeBron, what did you pick up defensively that allowed you to win this game? They, they broke us down still off the bounce. Uh, we want to do a better job of trying to keep our chest in front of them, but uh, we did a really good job of protecting their shots, and it allowed us to get on the balls and get rebounds. No rebounds, no rings. Congrats, LeBron. Thanks. Back to you. Thank you, David. Great interview once again. For Chris Weber, Greg Anthony, and David Olk, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. So long.